Welcome to the Learning Library of Arc Suppression Technologies, maker of NoSpark Arc Suppressors for AC and DC power switching applications. Today, we're going to take you through the simple installation of a NoSpark Arc Suppressor on a three-pole power contactor. In this case, the contactor is switching power to a semi-hermetic compressor located in the refrigeration rack house of a large grocery store. We'll follow along as Craig Dort, a trained HVAC and refrigeration technician with Johnstone Supply in Springfield, Missouri, takes us through the installation steps. Before we begin, here's some information about no-spark arc suppressors that you may find useful. No-spark arc suppressors protect motors from single phasing by extending the operating life of power contactors by at least 10 times. Patented and UL certified, no spark products accomplish this by eliminating 99.9% .9 of contact arc energy. Once the no spark arc suppressors are installed, the extended lifetime and increased efficiency of your contactors will in turn greatly reduce your costs associated with replacement motors, replacement contactors, scheduled maintenance, and unscheduled downtime. Before you begin any no spark installation, disconnect all power to circuits and panels where this product is about to be installed, and maintain power disconnection throughout the installation process. Assembly and installation must conform to the National Electric Code safety standards, as well as to locally applicable codes. Only authorized and qualified personnel should install and service the no spark arc suppressors. Failure to comply with these recommendations might result in damage to equipment and injury to personnel. Please read and thoroughly understand the applicable No Spark user manual and its associated safety warnings before beginning any No Spark installation. No Spark installation should be conducted only by a trained professional following all safety procedures described in the user manual. Before beginning this installation, turn off all power to the panel and then switch off the circuit breaker that sends power to the contactor. Confirm power shutoff by taking an appropriate meter reading from each pole of the contactor. Select the proper no spark product by comparing the locked rotor amperage, LRA, on the motor nameplate and the application voltage to the product selection chart found in the user manual. For this particular switching application, an LRA less than 195 amps and a voltage of 460, we'll be installing the 3PGGXA C1F480 arc suppressor. To begin this installation, identify the space on the panel on which you will install the NoSpark arc suppressor. Refer to the wire gauge table in the user manual to ensure the proper wire length. Next, install a DIN rail that can accommodate the arc suppressor installation. Note that wire length should never exceed 3 feet. Next, attach the GGX arc suppressor to the DIN rail, positioning the quarter inch quick connect connectors for easy wiring. Select the proper wire gauge and length as specified in the user manual. Cut six wires of equal gauge and length. Be sure to use appropriate fully insulated quick connects. Properly crimp each end of the six wires. Connect two wires to the first no spark arc suppressor. Once you've connected the first two wires to the arc suppressor, connect the same two wires to opposite sides of one pole of the contactor. Do not attach these wires to different poles. Connect the remaining pairs of wires in the same manner wiring them in parallel across each leg or pole of the contactor. And 
Once you have connected each of the three pairs of wires, double check that all connections are secure and tight. Lastly, use cable ties to cleanly bundle the six wires together. This completes the proper installation of a no-spark arc suppressor. As you can see, it's easy to wire to a contactor where it will protect your compressor and your contactor for a very long time. Reset the circuit breaker that feeds power to the contactor. Turn on the power to the panel. Thank you for viewing this No Spark installation video. For more information about No Spark arc suppressors and their uses in HVAC and refrigeration, please visit arcsuppressiontechnologies.com. Should you have any technical questions about product selection or installation, please give us a call at 612-928-5269 or email us at info at arcsuppressiontechnologies.com.